That's it. See you later. All right then. Thanks for this. You're welcome. Hmm. Grandpa! Grandpa! Huh? What is it, Ivan? Ta-da! Look at this! It's a letter for you! A letter? Yeah, here it is. It's been a while since I've actually received a letter from anyone. It's just not something people do anymore. What with that, that thing, e, e, um, uh, e, e, uh, what was that again? Email, Grandpa. Oh, yes, email. Yes, gosh, what tiny handwriting this is. I think I need you to help me read this, Ivan. Sure, Grandpa. How are you doing, Artie, my old buddy? This is Lee. I hope you remember me. Do you? What? Me? you will be able to meet up next weekend. Yours truly, Lee. Wow! Doesn't that sound great, Grandpa? It's really cool that he wants you to come visit him at his orchard for the new harvesting season. I didn't know you had cool friends like that, Grandpa. <laughs> I'm sorry, Ivan. I've gotten too old to remember all about the past. Honestly, I haven't seen Lee for a long time. It's been nearly ten years. He was one of my closest friends in the good old days. Uh, oh, I see. How did you two meet? Oh, that's a long story, Ivan. Oh, come on, Grandpa. You tell great stories. I'm sure it'll be fine. Just go. All right. When I was younger, one of my favorite things to do was to go camping with some friends. One day, we decided to go to the Lipor Gumbak Forest for a night's camp. Me and the boys really wanted to see the famous waterfall that was over there. Wow, that sounds so cool. So what happened, Grandpa? Hey, hold your horses. You're always in such a rush. <laughs> As evening approached, we finally reached our destination. We put up our tent, made a campfire, and bathed by the waterfall. That night, we cooked the fish that we caught and feasted on some tin food that we brought along with us. We stayed for two nights before heading back home. Unfortunately, our road back was not as smooth as our journey in. Somehow, my compass and map didn't make any sense, and we had to stay another night in the forest. <laughs> The next day, we continued walking, and finally we realized we were lost by evening. 
We couldn't find our way out, and by that time, we were all exhausted and had no energy left. I tried to stay awake, but somehow, mm, I fell asleep. I was so exhausted, I couldn't help myself. That morning, I was woken up by a group of people coming along the path. Mm. And that was our savior, your Grandpa Lee, who led us to his village. He fed us and eventually guided us out of the dark forest. If he had not saved us that fateful afternoon, we wouldn't be sitting here telling stories like this, Ivan. Wow, that sounds like a great experience. I bet you had a great time, didn't you? Um, so are you gonna meet with Grandpa Lee? I'm thinking about it, Ivan. What's up? Do you want to come along? Yeah! Uh, oh no! What's the matter? I've got a jogging session and a game with the boys. I gotta go now. I'll see you around, Grandpa. Goodbye, Ivan. Samuel, pass it here! Huh? Huh? Oh, a double defense! Didn't you know I specialize in dodging the defense? <laughs> uh. Whoa! Abel's coming after me! Uh. Ah. Whoa! That's not too bad, Samuel! <laughs> Do you think? Huh? That was a nice try, Sam, but it's not gonna help you if you stay distracted. <laughs> oh man, they've started playing. Darn it. Hey guys. Hey Ivan, get in here quick. You're on my team. Come on. All right, let's go. All of us played really well today. It looks like we're all getting a whole lot better at tackling. That's right, but wasn't that supposed to be like the original plan today? Tackling day? Well, I propose we have a defending day next week. How about it? Yeah, that sounds great, but I... What is your problem, Ivan? Next week, I want to go with my grandpa to meet his friend, Lee. Meet your grandfather's friend? Where is he, Ivan? In Gombak. He sent a letter to my grandpa. He even owns his own orchard. Well, harvest season. I wish that we could all go. Yeah, Ivan, it'll be cool if we all go together. Just let me ask my grandpa first. Maybe he'll let me bring all of you guys along on the trip. If you're going, and if your grandpa says we can go, count me in. Me too. Me too. And me, and me. Don't, Don't forget us. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's just hope that grandpa doesn't mind bringing the entire team along on the trip with him. Yeah. yeah! Ivan, dinner's ready. We're all waiting for you. Okay. Oh, Grandpa, have you told Dad about the letter you received yet? Thank goodness you reminded me, Ivan. Hey, Alex, do you remember your Uncle Lee? Ah, old Uncle Lee. I haven't heard from him in a while. What's up? He wrote a letter to me and wants me to go see him next week. Can you believe that? Really? That's great. You should go, Dad. I can drive you there. Is it okay if I bring Ivan along with me? That sounds like a good idea, Dad. And then maybe Ivan can keep an eye on you as well. Grandpa, would it be okay if my friends came along on the trip with us too? Is that so? I'm okay with that. Anyway, it's harvest season at the orchard, too. I'm sure the kids would love to go have a look. Mm. Please, Dad, can I go? Of course! <laughs> Ivan, aren't you ready yet? Grandpa's waiting for you. I'm almost done. Just a minute, Grandpa. Just a minute. It's okay, Ivan. Relax. Clothes, pants, towel, toothbrush, uh, what else? Ah, what am I forgetting? Ivan! Huh? Ivan! Dawn? Man, he got up early. Didn't we say 8.30? As soon as we arrive, I'm going to get some samples from the forest for my science experiment. I tell you fellas, I simply cannot wait to get there. Hey Ivan, do you know how long it'll take us? 
Um, how long is the journey there, Grandpa? It's only three hours. Are you boys all ready? Yeah! yeah. Right, let's go. Be Bye, careful, Ivan. you two. Bye, Ivan. I swear it's true. Huh? Well, I don't believe it. Well, I'm telling you, Ronaldo used to live in these woods. I wonder what we'll see there. This is gonna be so cool. It's been too long since we've met. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> this is my grandson, Ivan. And those are his friends. They wanted to tag along with me. Hmm. The more the merrier. Come on, let's take a walk to my village. But listen, kids, it really is a long walk. Responding to my letter so soon, Artie. No worries, Lee. It'll be good for us to catch I, up. Hmm. Do you know what the plans are? Now that we're here, I don't know what we're supposed to do. Neither do I. I think Grandpa has some plans for us, but he hasn't told me anything yet. Hey, Sam, getting old. <laughs> Dork. We're here, you guys. This is neat. This is just so cool. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, let me show you where you'll be staying, Artie. All right. some rest. Later on, we'll feast on some durians. A durian feast? Mmm. -hmm. That's great! Mmm. So good! These durians are great! Dig in! Dig in! You boys help yourselves! Wow, some durians just fell. Grandpa, is it okay if we go pick up those fallen durians? Hmm, sure, but be careful. No problem, sir. We'll be right back. Uh-huh. I'm coming with you! <sighs> <laughs> it's fine. All of you just go on. But if you see any durians, they're already open. Run back quickly, okay? Um, why is that? Hmm? That just means the durians have been opened and eaten by tigers. Got it? So don't linger out there too long, kids. Are you for real? In that case, um, it's okay. I'll just sit here with my durians quietly. <laughs> <laughs> Where do we have to walk? We're almost there. 
What a bummer. I was sleeping soundly until this guy woke us up. Yeah, dude, I was just dreaming I was a huge rapper. Awesome, dude. Yo, yo. Listen, do you guys hear anything? I know, we've got to be huh? near a waterfall, right? Good, Kevin, you've got great ears. <laughs> 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 All right, listen up. Huh? I didn't bring you boys here just to have some fun. Actually, I want you guys to have a good swim, because swimming is one of the best exercises there is. It doesn't cause much injury either, and after that, we'll move on to the next session. <laughs> what do you mean, Grandpa? To strengthen up your leg muscles, you guys are going to jog against the current. Sounds like Sean's special exercise. Just don't <laughs> drown. Trying to get out of training? Hey, would I do that? All right, after this, you're all going to follow me for some bird watching. The bird we're trying to observe is the bird of paradise, which is said to be very elusive. According to legend, a sighting of this bird will bring great joy to your life. In any case, there's something special to be learned from this activity. Bird watching teaches you to be patient, not to make any rash decisions, and also not to be greedy. We need to be aware and prepared for any opportunities. We have to stay calm because the bird of paradise can sense our weaknesses. Glad you saw the bird! It was great! That bird was so beautiful! It's not just pretty. It's widely known that all parts of the bird can be used to cure many illnesses. That's why many people hunt it. What I hope is you've learned something from this activity. Learn to control your emotions so you'll always be calm when playing football. You must all work hard to achieve that, kids. So tell me, can you all apply what you've learned in bird watching to your football matches? Yes, yes sir. sir! Thank you so much, Lee, for inviting us over. Thanks. You're welcome. 
I hope you've all enjoyed yourselves in my humble village. It was great. I'm going to get Grandpa to bring me here for the next school holiday and stay here even longer. The bus is here. You take care, Artie. 